hello, Ederson Oliveira here for DinningHero.com. In this video, we're going to be talking about this hero that you may have faced when either upgrading or installing a brand new DNN7 website. Okay, so why is this hero coming up? Very simple. It's because up to DNN6, you could run .NET Nuke with uh, .NET 2.0 or .NET 3 or 3.5, but coming up on DNN .NET 7, you could only run your DNN website with uh, ASP.NET Framework 4.0. So this is the problem. I'm running this site on my local system. So to change it locally, it's very simple. I just go to Start, Control Panel, from Control Panel, System and Security, Administrative Tools, and IIS. I have to open IIS. I have to expand here my IIS3. Here is my site. My site is using the application pool, sorry, not this option, basic settings, application pool called DNN7. I'm gonna go to the application pools, DNN7. It's using .NET Framework 2.0. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change this to 4.0. If by any chance, you do not have 4.0 on your list of .NET Framework versions is because .NET 4 Framework is not installed on your computer and you do have to install it. I'm going to put a link to the place where you can download .NET Framework 4.0, okay? So I just flip this to 4, click OK. I'm going back to the site and I'm going to refresh this, see what will happen. Let's wait for a second. And now we have the site up and running again, a DNN7 website. Now, I have just demonstrated a way to do that on your local computer. If you are running your site or upgrading your site uh, on, a, on a hosted server, on a shared environment, you may want to check your control panel uh, settings to see if there is a way to flip that to, to uh, .NET 4.0 or you may want to get in touch with your hosting provider to ask them for instructions on how to do it, or maybe they will do it for you, okay? But just remember to do that prior to upgrading a site, a DNN site, to DNN7, or installing a brand new DNN7 website. That's it for now, thank you very much, and bye.